Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to prevent Microsoft Edge from installing extensions. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up the Start menu. Just click on the Start button one time. Type in RegEdit, so R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best match should come back a registry editor. You want to right click on that and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to left click on yes. And now that we're in the registry editor here, I would highly suggest that you make a backup of it before you proceed in this tutorial. So if you ever needed to come back to it from the backup, I'm going to show you guys how to do that. So you're just going to go ahead and left click on the file, tap up at the top left, left click on export. Save the file name as something that will make sense, so usually the date in which you're making the backup is a smart decision. Export range should be selected to all. And then you want to save the file name as something, like I said, you'll be able to recognize. And then the location should be also something that will be easy to recognize and go back to. Once you're done with that, you, you would go ahead and click on save, so pretty straightforward. And then if you ever need to import it back in, you just would do file, import. And navigate to the registry file, so pretty straightforward. So now that you've done that, now you want to expand the HK Local Machine folder. So either double click on it or left one little arrow next to it to expand the drop down. Do the same thing now for the software folder. Now you want to do the same thing for policies. Please know you can follow the path that we're following on the top of the registry editor screen here. So if you want to pause the video or slow it down, you're more than welcome to. So anyway, after we've expanded policies, you want to expand the Microsoft folder. Now you want to right click on the Microsoft folder itself and left click on new and then left click on key you want to call this Microsoft Edge no spaces so capital M in Microsoft and E in Edge exactly it appears on my screen so again Microsoft Edge you can click out of it or hit enter and it should save the new key so now on the Microsoft Edge folder itself you want to right click on it left click on new and then left click on key now you want to type extensions exactly as it appears on my screen with a capital E Hit enter on your keyboard to save that. And now on the right side, you want to create a new D Word value. So right click in a blank area, left click on new, and then left click on D Word 32 bit value. You want to type in extensions enabled exactly as it appears on my screen. So it should all be one word, or should be all put together as one word, and the E in extensions and the E in enabled. So the first letter of both words should be capital, and there should not be any spaces in here at all click out of it or hit enter to save the name of that and now that you've done that just go ahead and double click on it one time make sure value data is set to zero left click on OK you can close out of the registry editor at this time and hopefully that should be about it so I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out and as always thank you for watching and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial goodbye